They said the Uyghur is hard to guard against an instrument. I've it significantly. I'll do a whole what I'll do a whole how I did it in um, another video. But basically, um, it's been kind of basically, basically been rebuilt. So I've got a whole set of new tangents which are tunable. I've added two additional, three additional keys. I'm thinking about maybe a third one to go here, but I have to be pretty clever how I do it. Um, but yeah, so it's got this, it's got a, it's got a, a sharp here and an octave key here, another additional key here. Um, I put a little floating bridge here. It turns out it wasn't actually necessary. I did actually put a little, a little, a little bridge platform here for the floating bridge, but it doesn't actually need one, which is nice. Um, it most I braced it significantly, so it's a bit stronger than a normal hardy, normal Uyghur's hardy gurdy. Um, it's got it's got an arch back. <laughs> I've curved the back. I've got another video how I did that. Um, you've got a sound post in it as well. I've also added uh, a proper crank and wheel. Well, the wheel's the original wheel. Just yeah, it's, it's not true entirely yet, but yeah, I could get it true, I suspect. Uh, I made an adjustable uh, chanter bridge and an adjustable drone bridge. I'm actually working on a, a trumpet for it as well, which I'm going to put a third string on the trumpet. Now, the, what's letting it down at the moment is the, the machine heads keep breaking on me, so um, I've had to sort of use this sort of pin thing on this dodgy machine head here. But, uh, which is what it slipped, the, 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 um, the base, the, the drone slipped there quite substantially just while we are playing that there. But that's just a case of fixing that. But yeah, the actual, the actual melody string plays quite well, quite loud. Um, find a little a bit of wood I can, I can show you what I mean. So I'll take the drone off just now because it's gone a haywire. But here's the, here's the melody string. I haven't tuned it yet for the other. It's, 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 it's never going to sound good, um, but it shows it can be done. Um, an exercise in what can be done. Positivity over negativity. Um, so yeah, a, play, a kind of, probably the only actual playable Yeager Hur Hurdy model in the world. Oh yeah, and also I glued it down as well, so it's substantially glued down. So if you want to make, it, make a volume of sound out of anything, it has to be sort of... It was quite a bit of work, I'm not going to lie, it was quite a bit of work, um, but you haven't had the end of it yet, so there's going to be more to it. I'll do a little video on how I did it, and a little explanation and a walkthrough if you want, if anyone's interested. But yes, can you make a, a Yu-Gi-Oh! Hardy Gurdy playable? Yes, you can. Didn't say you can make it sound good. <laughs> 